When you've always thought you were the center of the universe, it's not easy to admit you might have been wrong. So when some astronomer comes along to tell you that your whole world is actually revolving around the sun, you might feel, well, challenged. And if you're the Pope in, say, 1559, you might even establish an index of prohibited books and use it to prevent printers from publishing Copernicus's revolutionary theory. A century later, in 1660, Andreas Solarius used a picture to tell a thousand words. He produced Harmonia Macrocosmica, the most beautiful celestial atlas in history. He depicted the Copernican heliocentric theory, our Earth and the other planets moving around a central sun. But he also painted Ptolemy's long-accepted description of an Earth-centered universe, kind of a 17th century version of fair and balanced. He even included Tycho Brahe's compromise theory of some planets revolving about the Earth and that whole constellation of heavenly bodies moving about the Sun. The Church didn't buy that one either. All of these ingenious and beautiful images have now been reproduced, perfectly recreated, and can be had at discoveryeditions.com. See them with your own eyes. Rediscover them for yourself.